We're going to go back to the phone lines and we've got Steve holding for us from Warner Robins. Hi, Steve. Well, hey, listen, uh, um, uh, my brother's got federal workers comp. That's, is, that, is that all the same thing? No. It, it's uh, <laughs> that's two different animals altogether, unfortunately. And you would think um, with Robbins Air Force Base here locally and um, other federal post office and other federal employees that that would be a big area of practice um, and claims in our area, but it is not. And I will tell you why. Um, the federal government basically has legislated attorneys out of their federal process on workers' compensation. And if you have any disputes, you have to go all the way to Florida to have the initial dispute. So most attorneys have gotten into the situation where they don't handle federal workers' compensation because it's, it, from a business perspective, it's just absolutely a losing money kind of a thing because you can only charge, I think it's 10% now, as opposed to 25% in a state case and you have to go to Florida to do anything. So uh, it, it's, it is, the rules and regulations I should answer are very different for federal workers' compensation than they are for state workers or people that are under the state system of workers' compensation. But both systems are no fault. Both systems are no fault. Great questions from our viewers and from email. And